hello you guys welcome back to Kamonica's channel in this video I'm gonna talk about diet pills vitamins supplements all that greatness um, you guys asking a lot of questions about this and this video should have been up so long ago but I'm gonna just go into telling you guys about different things that I take um, and I'm gonna show you guys some things that I didn't like so yeah let's go ahead and get started I must say this I am not a professional MD is not behind my name okay I talk to my doctor I do research I advise you to do the same never start taking anything without seeking professional advice because what's great for me may not be so great for you okay again I am NOT a professional okay because these are things that's going into your body you know you only got one body so you want to take care of it and make sure you're doing the right thing okay so first I'm gonna start out with the one product that so many people ask me about so 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 many people ask me about and that is the psyllium husk okay and this is how it looks and I'm not gonna go into details about everything but I am gonna tell you guys everything that I've took on my journey I'm not gonna go into details about everything some products I don't use anymore some are just vitamins like coconut things like that that you can just you know google and it'll tell you the greatness of about them okay so this is how psyllium husk looks and how I take psyllium husk is everybody wants to know that because they say oh it's just it's clumpy it's clumpy okay so this is the thing um a psyllium husk it says it's gelatin free if I'm not mistaken um but it turn if you when you put it in water if you leave it in water like a minute it's gonna turn it's gonna start turning into a thick gooey substance okay so you get you an eight ounce glass of water and you put a whole tablespoon in and you mix it really fast like you mix it really fast and then just take it okay I do it every single morning it's the first thing I take into my body and I do it um, right before bed it's the last thing I take into my body um, some people take it completely differently that's just how I take it um, and I just put put a tablespoon in there stir it really quickly and drink it really really quickly so it doesn't get the opportunity to thicken up at all um, I've been taking it for so long off and on that I'm kind of used to it when I'm drinking it. I don't even feel the soft little, you know, whatever. I don't even feel it anymore because I've been taking it so long. Um, but also you can put it in food too. I mean, you can mix it in like yogurt, your smoothies, you know, things like that. You could put it in like anything that's not like completely, you know, liquid. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's not like watery because if it's water, it's going to thicken up. So you want to put it in something that's thick like yogurt or, you know, some kind of food or something like that. Um, also, a lot of people ask me about taking it in capsule. I do have the capsules. Um... The ones that I have is by GNC. And these are the ones I have. I don't really, if you if you are taking psyllium husk, I really don't encourage you to buy the capsules. Because in one tablespoon of um, like the, the whole husk, you're getting 5 grams of fiber. Okay? And in one capsule, you're only getting... 500 milligrams of um, fiber. So what is that? 0.1 gram, if I'm not mistaken. Y'all know how I am about math. So you would have to take what? 10? Is that right? Mm -hmm. 10, I think, um, of these to get what you would get in a tablespoon. So yeah, I know it's kind of tough to get down, but once you get used to it, It'll flow. It'll flow. I like I said. I suggest if you're taking psyllium husk, I suggest this um this particular 
um, the Silly Whole Husk. I suggest this. I don't know anything about the powder because I know they have powder. I don't know anything about that. So I can't really give advice about that. Okay, and the next product that I get a whole lot of questions about is the Cayenne. Um, at Walmart, it's called Cayenne Fruit. Okay, so what this product did for me, I was taking this product from the beginning of my journey. Now, what this product did for me was it curved my appetite. I felt, I didn't feel hungry like I was starving all day. And it assisted me in um, staying on track and staying on my journey. Now, how I took these, I took two in the middle of breakfast. Not, not before because if you take it before on an empty stomach, your booty going to be burning, okay? And if you take it after you eat, your throat is going to be burning. So in my opinion, this is not one of those, you know, diet pills where you're just like, Ugh, like anxious and you're just ready to run a mile or two. It's nothing like that, in my opinion. For me, what this did was it... It um, curved my appetite. It helped me not be hungry all the time. And I must say that this is what, this is like my holy grail of vitamin supplements, whatever. This is like my holy grail because this has helped me so much with my appetite. Like I, I took it the first year of my journey and it has helped me so, so, so much. I'm telling you, with curving my appetite. Um, most people, like my mom put me on to this. Most people that she tell about it, um, it works for them. They love it. You know, one or two people, you know, they don't see any difference. So, of course, it's not going to react to everybody. But it, this is, this is where it's at for me. It, oh, I could talk about it all day. It's just an awesome product. Um, so, yeah, no side effects or anything like that that I experienced with that. Um, the Celium Husk, um, I did tell y'all after maybe six months to a year of using that, it started giving me, like, horrible, terrible gas. So, I stopped using that for about six months, and now I'm back on it, and it's doing its thing. I love it. So, those are the main two products that I take every single day. Um, and those are the main two products a lot of people ask me about. So I did want to go over those. I already have a review for the Oxy, Oxy Light. I'm going to say Oxy Light. I know somebody corrects me every time. But anyway, um, I do have a review on this. I will put it um, below. I like it. It's a, it's a great product. I didn't have any side effects, but I've seen some reviews and some people were like really, really anxious behind it, you know. So, um... It doesn't work for everybody. That's why you have to, you know, consult your doctor. But, um, and I don't, I think, like, it has a warning for people with, um, high blood pressure or something like that. Probably most diet pills. But anyway, yeah, so I really did like that. I took this for about a month. And I still have some. It's 90 capsules. So, I took it for about a month. Um, I don't want... My whole purpose for trying that was something to help me um, break that plateau because around that time I had got on a plateau. But I'm not, my journey has never been about like really just consistently taking prescription or over the counter, um, you know, diet pills that um, have, you know, these different ingredients in it. I've tried to stay as natural as possible, but, but. Don't get it twisted. I'm not going to sit here and say that I won't try something else that is considered a diet pill. I'm just not going to sit here and say that. Um, I try not to, you know, overwhelm myself with all these different pills and stuff. That's why I've tried to keep it as natural as possible. But I'm not going to sit here and say that I wouldn't try another, um, you know, over-the-counter pill like this. I have never tried a prescription diet pill that I can remember. <laughs> I've never tried a prescription diet pill, so I don't I don't want to ever try one, but you never know what happened. That's why I yeah, I hardly ever hear me say I would never do something because you never know what happened, okay? You never know. 
so anyway so that's that that's that some vitamins and supplements things like that, that i really love i really love my coconut oil i really really love my coconut oil and i really really love my um cod liver oil oh i really love those two products i'm not gonna go into them i will um i will even find a, a link or something on google and put it below that gives you more information about those two products and of course you can google you can google them i also take b12 but i don't take b12 every day now also i take i don't take all of these every day the only two products that i take every single day is my psyllium husk and my cayenne fruit i have all of my medicine in like a little seven day you know medicine thing so i might take hot liver oil maybe three times a week okay and then I might take B12 maybe twice a week. And my coconut oil, same thing, maybe two, two or three times a week. Um, so, yeah. Those are those. And then supplements that did not work good for me is this multivitamin here. It always, every time I took it, it just made me feel um, sick on my stomach. And I really didn't like that. Um, so, yeah. And I, you know what? And after I thought about it, this might be the problem behind my, um, when I was trying to juice. Because when I started juicing, I started taking these. And, um, since I stopped taking these, my stomach hasn't, you know, been upset. Um, so this might be the reason, reason why I got so sick. Because I took, like, this particular multivitamin. And then I started juicing. And after I stopped juicing, my stomach still was upset when I, you know, the days that I I took that so that might be the reason why you know with the juicing and then that that just had me calling Earl so maybe that's what it is but whatever but I got this from Walmart and um so this particular vitamin here is a no-go for me it did not like me at all and then the last thing I want to show you guys is the women one a days women active metabolism i did not like this at all whatsoever because it had me jittery and anxious and um i didn't i didn't like this at all and this was probably about a year ago i still have this bottle here so i didn't like these because and this is how they look just in case you guys were wondering and like i said i have the name and the brand of everything in the description box so that is for the most part things that i've took on my journey um consistently you know i've tried different things i've done reviews on different things but these are the products that i took that i take consistently or i want to show you guys some things that i did not like or that did not like me okay so um i know a lot of you guys are going to have a lot of questions because like always i'm sure i left out a lot of information and i do apologize for that um as far as the most of these you can get from like wild Walmart. This particular brand, you can get it from um, the vitamin shop. Um, you can get it from, um, I think it's pronounced Vitacost. There will be a $10 referral code in the description box. So if you place an order with them, your first order, $10 off, there's no minimum. Um, and they do sell this particular brand, but also you can get this from the vitamin shop. Um... You can get like all of this from like the vitamin shop, Vitacost, Walmart, all of this. I've never seen whole husk in my particular Walmart. So you might have to go to like the vitamin shop or Vitacost or something like that. And I think that's it, you guys. Um, I hope that I touch bases with you guys and I answered as much um, as I could. Um, like I said, I'm trying not to overwhelm myself with taking all these supplements because I always say too much of a good thing is not always a good thing. Does that make sense? I don't think that really makes sense. What y'all think? I don't know. So, I will see you guys in the next one. My next video should be my favorites. It's going to be late because I want to get this out to you guys. So, you guys, don't forget to check out the description box for anything and everything. Um, I have all the information in the description box. Everything or anything I might have left off. Any concerns, any anything you may have, 
just put them in the comment box and you guys know I'll get to y'all as soon as I can. Yeah. So thanks guys so very much for coming back to Kamonica's channel. I love you guys so very much. Thank y'all for subscribing and sticking in here with me as long as you guys have. I thank y'all so very much for that. The support is amazing. Y'all have no idea. So thanks and I'll see y'all in the next one. I love you. Peace.